Welcome to Mathematics Pro. So today we are going to find the surface area of a square base pyramid given the base area and the volume. So let's get started. So looking at this pyramid, right, if we look at the net of a pyramid, we have the square at the base and we have four triangles. So this is this is it here so this is the net so they give us the base area so the area at the base is 144 so if we have 144 here this implies here is 12 and this is 12 because 12 times 12 will give us 144 so we have the area of the base already but we need to calculate the area of the triangles so we have four triangles in total we need to calculate the area of one of it times four so looking at this area we have the base of the triangle but we don't have the y now this height is the slant height so here we need to calculate the slant height so in order to do that let us draw a triangle in the pyramid so that we can apply Pythagoras theorem. So if we draw our triangle here, okay, looking at this triangle, we talk about the base already. So at the base, we have 12 centimeter. So the length of the base is 12. So half of it is going to be six. So what do we need next? We need to calculate this height so that we can apply Pythagoras theorem to calculate the slant height okay so to get the height we can use the formula of volume to get the height the formula of volume volume of a pyramid is equal to one-third of base area times the height divided by 3 so we can write it this form so writing it in this form we have been given the volume already so the volume is we just plug in the values the volume is 384 equals to the base area is 144 times h divided by 3 so to eliminate the fraction we can put this over one then we cross multiply so if we cross multiply we are going to have 144 h should be equals to 3 should be equals to 3 times 384 so this implies h will be equals to 3 times 384 divided by the coefficient of h which is 144 so we can simplify this 144 divided by 3 is 48 so 384 divided by 48 will give us 8 so this will give us 8 centimeter now we have this height which is 8 centimeter we can apply pythagoras theorem to get the slant height so if we apply pythagoras theorem can apply pythagoras theorem so if we apply pythagoras theorem we are going to have the slant height will be equals to the square root of 8 square plus 6 square 8 square is 64 6 square is 36 if we add them up together we have 100 the square root of 100 is 10 so this implies our slant height is 10 now we can calculate the surface area comfortably we have all that is needed so to calculate the surface area surface area 
will be equal to the base area this is our base area 144 plus the area of the four triangle so area of this triangle area is half base times the height so if we simplify this this we are going to have six 6 times 10 is 60 so we have 4 triangles so we are going to have 4 times 60 which is 240 240 so we just add the 240 here so if we add them up together we are going to have 384 centimeters square so this is the surface area. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.